Hey everybody, we're going to continue on with our precast project here. So right now, uh, here's our uh, 3D view of this. I'll just make this uh, shaded. So there's our 3D view. We have our wall panels in greatly enough. These became similes. Okay, and so now, if you go over here into the uh, project browser, and you can see down on the bottom it says assemblies. And if I expand this, there's each one of our walls. So we've got all our walls set up. So now the next important uh, drawing when it comes to wall panels, in my view, is the basement and these base plates. And I've added a few here. I'm going to have you have a look at this family here that I created. Cancel that. So this is our plate. It's going to be sitting on top of this. And if I look at this in wireframe, uh, you'll see that it's embedded in. OK, so let's go. So now, uh, let me close this guy up. No, I'm going to say it. OK. So now what happens here, we want to take these guys at least two feet from the edge. So I'm going to start here, and I'll place one here. And then from this one, I want to go two feet. So I'll just measure from here to here. Between each uh, panel, let's have two feet on each side. So let's make this four feet. So what I could do here, I can do something like this. I can copy these guys over. I'll leave that constraint. I'll go from this point to this point. I'll constrain that. Okay, and we'll just take these on through, like over here. So we've got another panel here. So we'll copy this guy across so you get the idea. I'm going to take him over four feet. Oops, gotta unconstrain that. Copy. Just constrain it here. Yeah. Let's go four feet from here. Oh, that's gonna be yep. So let's measure this guy over four feet. So I'm going to copy these guys in and then measure them later. So I'll just copy that one there. And then I'll make this. This is another one that I had used before. Actually. I'll take this guy out. That's the one I want to use before. I'm going to use it this time. So we're going to just, uh, okay. I'm going to copy this guy over to here. So we get all these plates in, and then we might want to duplicate this drawing and call it uh, embedding plan. So I got this one element, so I can just copy this guy through multiple. And we'll go measure this guy. I need my two feet from here to here. That's good. This one from here to here. This can be whatever the engineer says. So we get this whole side in. I might just mirror this one. But you guys get the idea what we're doing here basically we're, at, we're doing the embed place for the uh, the wall panel so if I go into this view and I do a wireframe you see our plates coming in okay so let's take this back to the uh, basement and I want uh, I'm gonna put these guys in and then we'll pick this up in the next video or let's go from here to here
So that's looking pretty good. So what happens is these plates are placed here, and then these panels are going to come and meet these plates. So that's why this drawing is very important for wall panels. So I'm going to just copy this guy over. I'll do this, make this quicker. Pencil this out. I'll copy these guys. Let me grab this one. Oops, sorry about that. That's what called me. <laughs> okay, control that. That. I'm going to copy this from here just to here. I'll pop one there and just delete that one out. And I'm going to get my two feet from the edge again. Let's put that over an inch. Move that one over again. Okay. So we've got our embedment plan going. Uh, you put these guys in all the way around, and I'm going to measure this out, and I'm going to pick this up in our next video where we'll have our embedment plan done, and then we'll do some reinforcing in the walls, and then we'll move on to something next. So, hey, guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to this channel. It helps me out make videos like this every day. So we're going to continue with this, and then I'll pick it up in the next video we'll look at reinforcing. Talk to you later. Everybody be safe. Bye. Please subscribe.